Greetings to everyone out there and welcome back to Around the Clock. After having a horrible launch of the GTA Trilogy Definitive Edition with reports coming out stating that these games have tons of bugs, issues, and all types of glitches, Rockstar Games has recently apologized for everything that went wrong. Here's their official statement. Hi everyone, we want to provide an update regarding the unexpected technical issues that came to light as part of the launch of Grand Theft Auto The Trilogy The Definitive Edition. Firstly, we want to sincerely apologize to everyone who has encountered issues playing these games. The Grand Theft Auto series and the games that make up this iconic trilogy are as special to us as we know they are to fans around the world. The updated versions of these classic games did not launch in a state that meets our own standards of quality or the standards our fans have come to expect. We have ongoing plans to address the technical issues and to improve each game going forward. With each planned update, the games will reach the level of quality that they deserve to be. A new title update is on the way in the coming days for all versions of Grand Theft Auto The Trilogy The Definitive Edition that will address a number of issues. We will update everyone as soon as it is live. In the meantime, it pains us to mention that we are hearing reports of members of the development teams being harassed on social media. We will kindly ask our community to please maintain a respectful and civil discourse around this release as we work through these issues. While one of the goals of the Definitive Editions was to allow players to enjoy these games on modern platforms for many years to come, we also understand that some of you would still like to have the previous classic versions available for purchase. We will be adding the classic PC versions of Grand Theft Auto 3, Grand Theft Auto Vice City, and Grand Theft Auto San Andreas back to the Rockstar Store shortly as a bundle. Additionally, everyone who has purchased Grand Theft Auto The Trilogy The Definitive Edition for PC from the Rockstar Store through June 30th, 2022 will receive these classic versions in their Rockstar Games Launcher Library at no additional cost. We will update everyone as soon as these are back in the Rockstar Store. Once again, we'd like to thank everyone for their patience and understanding while we work through these updates to ensure these games meet everyone's justifiably high standards. Sincerely, Rockstar Games. So, as you can see here, Rockstar Games laid it all out here. They literally apologized for everything that went wrong for these games when they launched, and they also stated here that if you bought these games on the PC, that you will be receiving the classic versions of these games at no additional cost. Plus, updates for the Grand Theft Auto Trilogy Definitive Edition will be coming soon to every single platform that these games are on. Now, of course, it sucks that these games launched with all types of bugs and issues, but it's also important and good to see that Rockstar Games came out and apologized in this way. Hopefully all of these updates for the GTA Trilogy come out soon so that everyone who has purchased these games can enjoy them the way that they are meant to be enjoyed. Alright everyone, that's going to do it for this video. What are your thoughts on everything that was discussed here? Please let me know down in the comment section. Make sure you check out my affiliate links down in the description box below to bestbuy.com. Also, make sure you like this video, share this video, and subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. And as always, remember to keep it locked here to around the clock. We're here. We focus on Nintendo gaming news around the clock. I'll catch you guys in the next one.